What's up guys, Brian back to talk about some Walking Dead news and Frank Darabont seeking over $280 million in the Walking Dead lawsuit with AMC. It's the bald guy there with the red circle around his face. If you don't know who Frank Darabont is, we'll talk about that in a second. But, huge lawsuit. We'll see who wins. We'll talk about this, but it won't be known for a while. Basically, eh, you know, copyright content here. You know, the pictures are AMC. Basically, comicbook.com is the article that we linked. We'll put the link in the description, and it's a pretty good article. You should check it out. Basically, the co-creator of AMC's The Walking Dead, Frank Darabont, and his agents have submitted a certificate of trial readiness in their lawsuit against AMC, which revealed the plaintiffs are seeking a damages verdict in excess of $280 million. AMC stands firmly against all claims being thrown at them by Darabont's team. Plaintiff's damages claim has no bias in reality, and we will continue to vigorously defend against his lawsuit, said AMC in the statement to THR. So, AMC's not budging. Frank Darabont about wants a piece of the pie and I don't blame him but if the paperwork's the paperwork there he is in season one he was the showrunner for season one and part of season two but we'll talk about that. Darabon served as a co-creator and showrunner of The Walking Dead through its first six episode season and was fired from the production halfway through the second. Following his departure AMC licensed the series to its cable affiliate network for an amount of money which Darabon's team claims was not enough. AMC argues that it to negotiate the right to set an imputed license fee. Darabont's contract entitled him to as much as 10% of certain The Walking Dead profits after deductions given the amount his team is filing for damages. The number suggests that the AMC series has hauled in multiple billions of dollars. Billions of dollars. And they probably have. It's a cash cow. There he is, season two. That's season one, probably, probably downtown, looking out there too. But we'll see what happens with the case. It's not going to be for a while, though. But the trial will highlight the circumstances surrounding Darabont's departure from the series as well. Darabont is alleging that AMC improperly reduced his profit share by not counting his efforts on the show's second season as being involved all year. He claimed to have worked on all episodes of the second season. A judge allowed the claim after initial deposition from Darabont, which revealed the crisis-level problems on the show. So he's saying he did the whole entire season of season two, but he was fired there. So he's going to miss out on some of the profits for sure. But there he is, Robert Kirkman. It's just a messy situation. I mean, season two did kind of mess up the series a little bit. Well, we'll see in season three as well. But don't expect to hear any updates from the case, even if it does move forward. Justice Eileen Branson has a full schedule at the moment and says... This case won't be dealt with until 2018 at the earliest. Should the case get the trial, it would be the biggest profit cases in television history. So 2018, that's crazy. Two years away to even get this to. I'm sure Darabont is doing other projects or whatever. He's not relying on this money, but you know it's kind of crappy, this whole situation. But like I said, season two, The Farm, Sophia, you know, it was kind of a weaker season. To my eyes, it's probably the weakest season it did kind of change the dynamic of the show going forward with Dale and everything who was supposed to be there and who was this and that. But, you know, there's a good shot of the group there on Herschel's farm. You know, what's going to stand out for me is season two is Herschel with the unlimited, unlimited ammo in the season finale when he's picking off the walkers there too. He fires a million shots. I don't know how he did that in that shotgun, but... You know, we're going to need Herschel to pick up Rick going forward. But thanks, guys, for watching. You guys are awesome. Like, share, subscribe. Subscribe to keep these awesome videos coming. If you like the channel, let us know. Post your comments what you liked and what you want to talk about next. Thanks, guys, and you guys are awesome.